The research is very clear that students who attend technical college have a great success rate and moving forward have a great success rate in getting jobs. And it shows that most of the people who end up with the technical degrees end up staying local, either within the state or even in their communities. So it keeps families together and that's always, a, always an important task. We think about the technology that's coming into this marketplace today at a very accelerated rate. Some people could be nervous about that, but the reality is it creates even more opportunities for our young people that like technology, like these skill sets, but also then can support a family and build their careers and their career paths. You know, right now, if you go on to the construction trade side of the, of the equation of, of out there, you know, there's a little over a couple million jobs available uh, out there. If we go on to HVAC, this is one of the highest areas of climate and energy control. That, again, that train is a, a recognized world leader in this, and, and there's 20, 30, 40 percent increase in jobs over the next 10 or 15 years in this. So research says it's here already, okay, it's, it's going to be there for the long term. Really looking at the developing workforce and the changing nature of, of technical uh, expertise in many of the, the 21st century fields that are developing, it's important that people um, get involved with business and industry and understand um, what those skill needs are. These are wonderful careers and they're high tech and they're high wage and they're high demand. So whether it's aviation, whether it's manufacturing, whether skilled it's skilled trades, transportation, energy, healthcare, whatever that may be, it is an absolutely wonderful, wonderful opportunity and it is not your grandfather's vocational career technical education. So we were a pioneer school with uh, NC3. We were one of the very first schools that jumped on board with NC3. And NC3 has been a really, really wonderful partnership for us. Partners like the train company, like Snap-on, Fiat Chrysler. Um, these are great companies to be associated with and it's such a win-win for students because not only are we validating the good work that they're doing, but this gives you a third party that's actually also providing that certification and that assessment. Uh, when we got to Washburn Tech, the first thing we did became a Snap-on College, and, and of course that was what's involved with uh, NC3. And over the next four to five years in the process of our instructors being trained and training the trainers in automotive or in um, uh, energy, um, what happened of course in that process is that NC3 brought other opportunities to us. So with them though, we, we feel like we're so much more advanced than uh, over the last six years. So it's been a tremendous partnership with um, our industry partners. Um, obviously, uh, we're here today with the Train Corporation and then of course um, uh, NC3. Train has a program called the BTU Crew and the BTU crew has been around since 2009. And what it is, is it's project-based learning. So these students can do experiments, do audits of their buildings, so they're aware of their surroundings. Just this year, uh, we will be um, certifying over 15,000 students with some type of NC3 certification. They retain the students, they graduate, they receive those certificates, and then they're able to go into the workforce immediately. So the trajectory and the research says that it's a very good opportunity for students. The skills are transferable because the certifications are nationwide. So if they decide to go elsewhere, it's also very easy for them to find jobs in other locations as well. Our students are very driven. Uh, they're there for a reason and uh, they complete their programs. And again, they, they tend to return to where they came from.